Forming greatest and smallest digits, it's very easy to do. Only we should be careful about zero. If zero is one of the digits given, then we should be very careful. Yes, today's topic is about forming the greatest and the smallest number using the given digits. Let's start the topic and welcome to our new session of mathematics. So, here I'll give you a five digit number. Okay, first I'll give you a very simple number. Then later we will use some zeros. Okay, now without zero, only I'm using the natural numbers. So, 1, 9, 7, 8, 2. These are the numbers. 1, 9, 7, 8, 2. These are the digits given. We have to form the greatest number using the digits. So, the greatest number. For the greatest number, we have to take the biggest digit. Which is the biggest digit here? Yes, it is 9. Then what about the second biggest? Yes, it is 8. Then come 7. Then come 2. Then 1. Okay, 9, 8, 7, 2, 1. That is 98,721. Then what about the smallest? It is 4. Forming the smallest digit, we have to write the smallest number first. Which is the smallest number here? Yes, it is 1. Then comes 2, then 7, then 8, then 9. 12,789 is the smallest possible number we can form using the digits given. Okay? Is this easy? Yes, it is so easy, right? Then, as I told you, only you have to be very careful about zero. I'll show an example. Eight, zero, three, four, one. 80341. So, how many digits are here? Here we have 5 digits and 0 is also there. So, let's start with the greatest number. Okay, so which is the greatest digit here? It was 8. Then, the second greatest is 4. Then, what about the third? It is 3. Then, 1, 0. 84310. Okay. Then what about the smallest number, smallest possible number we can form using the digits. Here the smallest number is 0, right? But we can't write 0 first. Why? If 0 comes in the first, it don't have any value. If 0 stands with any number, it value, the number's value will increase. If 0 stands with 1, what is the value of 1? The value of 1 will increase by 10, right? Similarly, the 0 stand with any number, the value of that number will increase. But 0 stand alone don't have any value. So 0 should not come first. 0 should be always should come in the second place, okay? Then what will be the first number? Which is the second smallest number here? Yes, it is 1. 1, 0, 3, 4, 8. That means 10,348. Got it? If 0 is there, 0 should come in the second place. Okay? The second smallest number should come first. Here 1 is the second smallest in this row. So 1 should come first. Then we can write 0. I hope you understood. Yes. So, Let's start with another example. I'll give you one number. You have to do. Okay? You have to work out. So, here is the number. 74501. 74501. Take a paper. Please form the greatest and smallest possible number using the digits. Yes. So, what is the greatest number? Look at here. Got it? Do you have the same answer? Then what about the smallest? It's here. 
Yay, you also got the same answer, right? So do practice. I hope you all understood. Have a good day.